So what's up all you Star Wars fans? This is the Jedi News Channel. And I've got a question for you. Do you ever wonder what it would be like to travel in hyperdrive? What if you were on the Millennium Falcon and you got to travel at the speed of light like we get to see in the Star Wars movies? Now for me, I think it would be awesome, especially by the way it's depicted. All the lights coming towards you and then you're traveling through the center of it, right? Well, a study from the University of Leicester, I hope I'm saying that right, a group of final year students there put together a study on the physics of hyperdrive, based probably off of what we see in Star Wars. And what they've actually determined is that it wouldn't look like how we see in the movies, which is unfortunate and disappointing. It would actually, rather than the lights coming to you, just be one big blur of light as you travel at the speed of light. But the study that they did is actually really interesting because it goes through the effects that hyperdrive would have both on the person and on the ship, what would be needed for a ship to go through that, and then they also talk about obviously what it would look like when you actually go into hyperdrive. So check the link below if you want to see more about the study, more from the students and what they got and the physics of it. Um, there's actually a really cool piece in there where they talk about the Doppler effect. And if you don't know what that is, there's actually a link where you can watch Sheldon from the Big Bang Theory explain it. And so all of this goes into this study to say that the way Star Wars depicts hyperdrive is not quite what it would end up looking like. So it'll be interesting to see if they actually change how it looks in these new movies. In the new trilogy, does Disney choose to get a little more scientifically correct with their hyperdrive? Or do they stay with that same image that all of us have when we think of a ship, or especially the Millennium Falcon, traveling at the speed of light? It'll be interesting to see, but make sure you come back here to the Jedi News Channel for all things Star Wars.